<laughs> Hello Zedheads, welcome back, it's ZedTube and today I am starting a brand new survival series which I'm going to be calling Insane Nightmare. I've given it that name because I've made the difficulty level insane. We're on 30 minute days with a horde every night. We've got a range of three days so it might not actually be every night, we might have a three day window where the the hordes will happen but i have turned off the blood moon warning so we basically have to assume that every night is going to be a horde night although we're not going to know until 10 pm the the speed of the zombies is set to nightmare and to make it slightly easier because we've only got 30 minute days i've upped the xp to 200 percent and i've also upped the loot abundance up to 200 percent so that's the basic settings so without further ado let's get going we need to get going fast we've got 30 minute days i'm going to run through the initial quests as quickly as possible and then we're going to find where the trader is and then i'm going to find somewhere hopefully semi safe for me to sleep or hide <laughs> more like Okay, so the trader is 600 meters that way. Okay, a um, few things I need, plant fibers. So there's a couple of things I'm gonna do a di bit differently than how I would normally play. Uh, sledgehammer is pretty standard, but I'm also gonna build a spear. Uh, I'm gonna keep the club as well. Okay, let's start making our way towards the trader let's go and i'm gonna loot anything that looks interesting just get some little bits of loot here and there where i can bit of glue there that's not bad hello it's editing zedtube here something i wanted to mention if you've got this far in the video i've been looking at my stats recently on youtube and over 85 percent of my viewers are not subscribed to my channel so if you like what you see, why not click the subscribe button? It really helps me out, it costs you nothing, and everyone wins. Okay, I'm gonna take this tree trunk apart. Because you sometimes get honey out of them, and that would be good if we did get an infection. That would deal with that straight away, it should be quite good. If we can get one, yes we did, sweet. Nice, we've got some brass there 500 brass that's quite a lot good amount of brass now skill points wise i'm basically going to be going into strength and stamina and i think i'm going to put all of my points starting off i'm going to put all four into strength straight off and then as we level up we'll put points into sexual tyrannosaurus uh into the two melee damage skill points and then probably start going into cardio pretty quickly okay we got a we got a cheerleader okay let's deal with our first zombie this is how we're going to deal with these zombies and i missed her try that again how did that miss? That went right through her legs. I saw it go. Okay. We woke her up. So if we're on this tower, we're kind of safe. We can throw... Damn it. We can reach our spear. From here. Look how fast they go. Jeez. Alright, carry on. She's dead. So the trader's up here somewhere. Ooh, that's a nice looking POI right there. And there oh okay, we've got a we've got a businessman. He's looking for some business. And, alright, he didn't, I thought he was coming for us, but he's kind of stopped. Alright then. 
<laughs> interesting. Right, so the trader's here. That's good. So we know where the trader is. So I think um, what I'd like to do is get somewhere safe-ish. Um, I need some more arrows, so let's make a few more arrows. 29, that's good. Right, that, that guy, I need to deal with him. Because he's going to cause me trouble. I can actually hit him, that'd be good. Here he comes. See, that, that building there would be probably quite good to build on. It's got a nice flat roof. Um, I think that's probably going to be our first summer to just settle down for the night. Uh oh. Got someone else. What? Okay, she's dead. Right, it's 2.30 p.m. already. Right, we need to... We need to... You know what, I'm going to leave a, a block there, just in case. We need to jump back up there quick. I'm going to repair that. No, I can't repair that. There's a zombie there coming in. Uh, right, there's a stone. We can't pick it up because of the dam. Let's just get one stone, please, so I can fix my spear. Right, let's get up this roof, up this rooftop, and is there anyone up here? Can't see, I was looking for birds, I can't see any birds, can't see anyone, oh, oh okay, it's just one of them, those crawler guys, that's not too bad, he can... So I'm going to go past him quickly first. Just want to check around the other side. Is anyone there? Doesn't look like it. Okay, so we've got this guy. We'll kill this crawler guy. And then we'll... Okay. Right, we'll get some medical supplies. Excellent. Some feathers. Excellent. That place looks cool. Is that like a dirt bike? Like motocross track or something? Nice. Okay. Got something here. Ooh, a weapons bag. Ooh, six pipe bombs. Okay, that's nice. So is he... Who have we got down here? He's going to make his way up here. Hope not. Right, I think I might jump down. Yeah, I'm going to jump down. I'm going to jump on my little tower. And I'm going to deal with this guy. What? dead okay so it's 5 p.m let's go and check out the trader we'll go check the trader and then i think that's gonna be us really we're gonna have to see if we have a horde night hopefully not oh oh crap okay yeah he's after me he's after me okay yoink oh that was close Man, he dodged that. He saw, everyone saw that. Dodging zombies. He's dead. Okay, 6 p.m. Okay, it's going fast this time. This time is going fast. We'll read that. Okay, let's get in the trader. Right, okay, so if we can get in here and find a cooking pot, that'd be great. 
Oh yes, there we go. Two cooking pots. Sweet. That is good news. Okay, so that means we can cook some stuff and we are not going to starve to death. So hopefully there's a forge. A working forge would be amazing. Come on. Damn it. Destroyed. Oh, yes. We've got a forge recipe though. Sweet. That's good. Uh, the cement mixer is not working. And is there anything in here? Yes. Chemistry station. Oh, yes. And a chemistry station. Oh, damn. Hey, Wolf. You stay there, mate. Is that working? The workbench would be good. Come on. Oh, damn. Doesn't work. All right, then. Never mind. Um, right, let's go see the trader quickly. Before we run out of time. You need assistance. Yep. Uh, right, can I sell you? What can I sell you, sir? Okay, what have you got to buy? Uh, can I? Have you got any good weapons? Hunting rifle would be nice. Don't have enough for that. Uh, we've got 800 bucks, so that's not very much money at all. We could get some of these. Iron arrows might be good. I'm going to buy those. Yeah, we're getting them. Um, anything else? A pistol? Can't afford it. Hunting rifle? Can't afford it. Um, okay, I it's think that's been it. A real pleasure. You um, watch yourself out there. Have you got any jobs? I'll have a job. Clear zombies. 400 meters. No matter what, I'm grateful for Can we get in is done? Is safe before the time runs out. Is that gonna work? I don't know. I think we might get kicked out. Get in the safe before the time runs out. Come on. Yes, we're in. Okay, nice. I'm having those and I'm out of here. We need to get up on our rooftop soon as oh crap there's a guy i can see him he's after me Fart! okay we need to get up our on our rooftop as soon as possible. Trader Joel's is now closed. Oh, okay, we made it up just in time and it's not a horde night. Wow, okay, let's put our bedroll down. I'm gonna put a block there and we need a storage. Whew. Uh, let's make, yeah, one of those storages. I'm gonna read that. Let's put a storage there and get our inventory sorted out. Okay, that's us. Okay, so I think that is us for day one. Uh, we've got somewhere to live. We have, I can hear a zombie down there. What is she up to? Okay, she's gonna just bang on stuff down there okay fine well so that's day one um we've got somewhere to stay we survived barely yeah uh, we've got another skill point so what i'm gonna do is put that straight into here uh sexual tyrannosaurus we're gonna go we're gonna alternate between pummel pete skull crusher and sexual tyrannosaurus for the first few levels because if once we get up to level three on that we're gonna have loads of stamina um then we'll think about going into perhaps fortitude and cardio i think might be a good idea as well 10 percent stamina regen yeah we're gonna need that so i'm gonna spend the rest of the night uh digging out a couple of these blocks perhaps and see if i can get some stone out of it and then so i can repair my 
weapons, my spear and things. And probably listen to that woman hit on that wall. So I hope you enjoyed that episode. This is day one of Insane Nightmare. Let me know in the comments how long you think I will survive. And while you're there, click the like button. And if you're not subscribed, click subscribe. Hit that notification bell. And I will see you in the next one. Thanks and goodbye.